Good evening, everybody. Hi. How's it going tonight? Good evening, teacher. I'm great. Okay. All right. Ernesto, what's up? Can you hear me? What's up, Ernesto? Can you hear me? Okay. Uh, today's payday, right? <laughs> <laughs> you're happy. I can see you're yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ah, okay. You're having problems with your internet. Okay. Don't worry about it. Um, we're going to do tonight, we're going to do the final exam. Okay. Here it is. Here it is. Okay. We're going to start from the last question to the first. Okay. Here it is. Okay. Uh, Wilbur, can you start reading? Okay, okay, this. Audrey, okay, uh, a two. A two. Mm -hmm. Okay, Audrey Tattoo. Audrey Tattoo is a young French actress. Actress. A actress. Okay. She has fans around the world. Here are some interesting things about Audrey's life and career. Okay. Um, 1978, huh? Audrey is born in Ber Bermont, Bermont. Bermont. Bermont, France. 88. 1880, 1980s, 1990, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, for her acting on French TV, 1999. Right. 2000, um, 2002. 2000, 2002, Audrey acted in many movies, including Boyos, Boyles, Boyel. Boyal. Boyo Boyal. Boyo Boyal. 2000. 2000. Then, she plays a young woman called Emily. Emily. Emily, in a movie of the same name, Emily, 2001. Is in Emily is in um, French. Is in a French. The film is a big international hit. Audrey becomes popular in many countries, including. The United States. Audrey, Audrey also acts in a film called called Gold is Great. I'm not 2002. Mm -hmm. 2003. Audrey has a big year. She acts in the Spanish apartment and he loves me. He loves me. He loves me not. She also acts in Dirty Pretty Thing. This is the first time he speaks English in a movie. Mm -hmm. Okay, so question one. In high school, Audrey Tatu acts. Audrey Tatu is a young French actress. She has fans. Around where are she is born in Beaumont, France. Beaumont. Audrey has in vain, especially comedies in high school. In a high school. So the answer is, it's Audrey Tattoo. 
acts what is the answer what is the answer in lima what is, what is the answer <laughs> Uh, no, no. Okay. A Molina, good evening. A Molina, Mr. Molina, good evening. Uh, in the final, in the, in the second section. Uh huh. For in play. For his in play. In play. Oh. Very good. Of the reacting place. Oh, yes. Play. Uh, in place yes. in, high school. in high school. Okay. What is uh, A Molina? Question two. May Mary like the movie? That's the movie. Uh -huh. Aha. Many, many, yeah. many Americans like the movie. Will you get Amali? Emily. Emily. Okay. Mm. Okay. If, Yo, all right. Audrey becomes mm -hmm. popular in many countries, including the United States. Audrey also acts in the film. The question is, question is, many Americans like the movie. Many yes. Americans like the movie. Okay. She wins the prize. The prize best newcomer for for her acting on French TV. Audrey acts in many movies, including then she plays a woman called Emily in a movie of the same name. French, but the film is a big international film becomes popular in many countries, including the United States. Okay. okay. Audi also acts. Uh -huh. So, the, the, what is the answer? Number two. Emily. Uh, Emily. Right. Here, here. Emily. Emily. And then they like it. That's okay. Number three. Audrey acts in three movies in Audrey acts in three movies in three movies. Audrey acts in three movies. Okay. In 2003, Audrey has a beard. She acts in the Spanish apartment and loves me. He loves me. She also acts in very three little things. Okay. So in what year in what year? Number Audrey acts in three movies in what year? 2003. 2003. Okay. Very good. Now, number four, Emolina. In her movies, Audrey usually speaks. In her movies, Audrey usually speaks English, Spanish, or French. 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 All right. Uh -huh. Okay. All right. Here we go. Ready? Yes. I am. Wow. All right. Okay. We're going to do multiple choice. Okay. okay. What's the choice of the word? J does everything for breakfast. Yoga, football, yoga. That is the sound for supporting that dish. Uh, let's see. No, I, I think it's very logical. Logical. Oh, okay. okay. Before, what can you do before breakfast? Jogging, yoga, or ah, uh, okay. Let me see. Let me see. The sentences use uh, apply does. Okay, they does. Is it yoga, 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 yoga or yoga? Da, ra, ra. Okay. How often do you swimming in the summer? Do you swim? Do you swim? Play swimming or go, go swimming? Huh? Go swimming. Go swimming. All right. Sometimes I play with my friends. Sometimes I play with my. Sometimes I play in skating, aerobics, or baseball with my friends. Baseball. Baseball. Five right, hundred. Good job, Mo. This exam is too easy. Too easy for you people. Okay, next week is the last week of the course. Okay. Okay, yes. Uh next week we are going to be taking exams. The three oh you have to finish section five. I mean sec all the sections and take the final exam too. Okay. And uh we're gonna be uh we're gonna be taking exams. You're gonna be taking exams that I will give you. Okay, exams that I have that you're gonna like.
Okay, but uh, and I do a lot of attempts so that if you want to practice in your house, you will be able to do something. Okay, let me erase it. Okay, so here we go. Hey, Molina, complete the sentence with do, does, or would. Okay, you like to see a movie tonight? Sure, what time does it start? And the answer should be? Do you like your movie tonight? Sure. What time does it stop? Well, do you like Would you? Oh, right, right. Do you like horror movies? No, not really. What do you do? Do you like horror movies? No, really. What kind of music does friend Rick like? What kind of music does your friend Ricardo like? In this case, it's well, um, on either list who does. Ah, this is the third singular friend, Ricardo. In, 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 the, in the case that this sentence has the, the subject, your? No, because it's your, your friend, Ricardo. Your friend, Ricardo. Ah, okay. Yes, I, was it so? Was it? Was it? Uh, yes. Ah, uh, yes, but this is he. This is he. Yes, yes. Your friend. Okay. All right, all right. Complete conversations, use presentations of the verbs. How is your sister? He's next. It's a question. Yes, she's All she's right. right. It's a question. Look. Good. Is she studying? Yes. No, she isn't. Where yes. is like a grocery store? No, she isn't. No, she isn't. She's working as a or she works. You put she's working or what? She I think she works. She is working as a cashier at a grocery store. I think it's she is. She is. Okay. Is that David over there? Uh huh. Who? Four. Is that David over there? Who? Who is, okay. who is he waiting for? Who is he waiting for? Okay, the last one is Aunt Maggie. She is coming on the bus or comes on the bus? She's, she's coming. She's coming on the bus. Bam. Good job, people. You got a hundred. Very easy, Sam. Okay, and here comes the list. List of separate answers. Okay. All right, ready to go. How many sisters do you have? Sister you have? Did, did you hear it? No, you should be talking. One more time, one more time, one more time. How many sisters? Okay, four sisters. Okay, four sisters. We all dinner together each night. All my brothers and sisters and my parents. How fun. It's like having a party every night. Yeah, I guess it is. Oh, Two. Sure. Hi, Mark. Nice to see you again. Hey. Okay. So, Catherine has four, seven, or nine brothers and sisters. In this, in this case, it's four of these. Four. But, but she has, she has. Brothers and sisters, right? Okay. So how, it's seven, teacher. Seven, seven, right? Seven is the answer. Catherine has four sisters, four, and three okay. brothers, and three brothers. Okay. Listen to the other. Where are you working now? I'm working full time for a newspaper. I'm a photographer there. Wow, that's interesting. Are you still living at home? No, I'm not. I'm living in an apartment with Jim. He's an old friend. So you're not married? No, I know. But I am getting married. Congratulations. Okay, so nowadays, Mark is living with his wife with a friend. Okay, and the last one 
Sharon, Sharon usually goes to the gym. How many times? Okay. Oh, do you have advice to me? Okay. And do you ever go to the gym? Yes, I usually go on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Wow. How do you Okay. Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. How many times does she go to the gym? Three, three times a week. Three times a week. All right. Okay. Okay. What about oh this one? Some of the man's younger brothers and sisters. Some of the man's younger brothers and sisters. Okay. About two years ago. That's for sure. Four. Listen to this, Kylie. It says here in Australia, most married couples have children. Oh, that's true. My parents have two kids. What's their name? In my country, really big families. There are twenty in my family. That's amazing. And are they all living at home? Well, some of my younger brothers and sisters are still in school and living at home with my parents. A few of us older ones are married with children. Are you all living in the same town? No. My two older brothers are single and working abroad, but the others live near our parents in the same town. And the answer is... Some mm. of the men's younger brothers and sisters are in school, have a child, are working abroad. I understand, teacher, uh -huh. but um, have a one child. Have one child. Have okay. One child. Okay. I work abroad. I work. Our, Oi! Okay, try this. Are working abroad? Are working abroad? Are working abroad. I are in school. All right, all right, people. Very good job. This is the exam. Very simple, very easy, okay? Okay, now, uh, Emolina, did you finish all the sections? Ernesto Molina, did you? I finished a exam, teacher. Oh, the exam, the final exam? Yes, teacher, I finished. And, 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 and second Yes, five? I finally exam. And, and, and section five, teacher. Okay, great. And you, Wilbur? No, teacher, not yet. The final exam, no, but I started the section five yesterday. You're, oh, you finished it yesterday? No, no, not yet. Uh, okay, so do you have any questions from section five? Really not, teacher. At oh. this moment, no. Okay. I think it's very easy, right? Right. Okay. So, all right. Uh, this week's topic was okay. Um, let me see. Give me one moment. We have to go back to section five. So we're gonna try to do section five backwards. Okay, backwards. Here it is. Backwards means de atrás para adelante. Backwards. Backwards. Okay. It's reading exercise, the things in family. Thinking family. So we'll be in here too. In three and two. Okay, let's do the reading. Let's do the reading, people. 
Okay, make it bigger. Here we go. A Molina, can you read? Okay. Okay, American families are changing. One import, important thing is that most married women no work outside at home. What happens when both parents work? Read about the Morales family. Judy and Steven Morales have three children. John, 12, Ben, 9, and Emily, 6. Steve is a computer programmer. The, this year, Judy is working again, again as a hospital administrator. The family needs the, mo need the money, and Judy likes her job. Everything is going well, but there but there are also some problems. Oh, okay, okay. Um, Wilbur, read, read one and two. Read one and two, wait. Here we go, here we go. Now that the duty is working. Now that Judy is working, Steve has to help her more with the housework. He doesn't enjoy it. Jude loves her work, but she feels too tired and busy. She also worries about the children. Judy has to work on Saturdays, so Steve and Judy don't have a lot of free time together. Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead. Keep, keep reading. Keep reading. Okay. Emily is having, is having a great time in her after-school program. When Judy comes to pick her up, she doesn't want to leave. All right. Uh, Emolina, unfortunately... Um, for, uh, repeat, please. Unfortunately... Unfortunately... Fortunately, Ben's school doesn't have an after-school program. Right now, she's spending most afternoon in front of TV. Josh is enjoying his new freedom after school. He's playing his music louder and spending more time in the, in the phone. He's also doing a few household chores. Chores. Which children are benefiting from Judy working? Uh, Josh and Emily. Josh and Emily. Josh and Emily. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Okay. She has mistake in this word, teacher, in this name. Emily with E. E Emily, yeah. Uh ah. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Emily. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right. Thank you. Very good. Very good job. Okay. Which child is not benefiting from Judy working? Ben. Ben. <laughs> ben. It says Ben's school doesn't have an after school program. Right now, he's spending most afternoons in front of the TV. Okay. Uh, which family member is enjoying more freedom? Family memory in general. Uh huh. Spending more time with you know, the household chores. Who's spending? Who is? Okay. Emily is having a great time and her afternoon program. 
Judy comes, she doesn't want to leave. John is employing his new freedom after school. After school. Who? Josh. 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 Okay. Josh. Which family members are doing more housework? Which family member are doing more housework? Which family member is the, the dialogue? Which family members are doing more housework? Let me see the dialogue. Okay. Here we go. Are doing more housework. Housework. Uh -huh. Okay. Here we go. Now Judy is working. Now that Judy is working, Steve has to do, has to help more with the housework. Steve. 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 And who else? It's, it's Judy and Steve. Judy and Steve. Judy and Steve. G Steve and Josh. See, Josh. Okay, here it is. Josh. Steve and George. George is enjoying his new freedom after school. He's playing his music louder and time on phone. He's also doing house, household chores. Household chores. So it's Steve George. and George. Which George. family member feels too busy? Too busy. Judy. Judy. Okay. Bam. All right. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> what is the answer, people? What is the answer? Emily and Josh. Emily. And Josh. Teacher, that means the, the order to... The, the order, yeah. Let me see. What the mistake? It's a mistake, the order. Oh, uh, okay. Okay, now we got it right. Okay. Here it is, Emily and Josh. Emily and Josh. All right, all right. Now, um, we're gonna do, that's the reading exercise. Okay, here we go, here we go. Now, read the following sentences, select the response with the quantifier that poses a meaning. Okay, in China, 50% of the women get married by the age of 20. 50%, does it mean a lot of women, a few women, or all the women? A lot of women? A lot of women, okay. A lot of women, right? Yeah, yeah. A lot of women. In Australia, 87% of, of married couples have children. What is the meaning of 87? Not many, some, 
for nearly all. Near all, Maori? Nearly all. Okay. In the United States, 0% of the people vote before the age of 18. A few, all, or no one? No one. No one, no one. 35% of the people in Germany live alone. 35, some, a few, or most? A few? What some. Is, some. 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 Seventy-eight percent of American high school students have jobs. Seventy-eight percent of American high school students have jobs. Most American high school students have jobs. Not many. Maybe most. Most. Maybe most American. Most. Most. Okay. There we go. A hundred. Very simple. Very easy. Okay. Uh, let's do... Lou at Sam, look at Sam's family. How are these people related to him? Oh, we did it, we did it, right? Okay, here we have Andy, Marta, Chris, Sarah. Donna, Manuel, Sam, Yumiko, Jim, Lisa, Teresa, Kelly, and Jimmy. Okay. Grandfather and? Grandmother. Grandmother. Mother and Chris is the what? The father. The father. Aunt and? Uncle. Uncle. Sam and? And his? And his? And his wife. And his wife. Jim, Lisa. Okay, brother and? Sister. Sister and Teresa? Sister-in-law? No. No, Teresa is the- Teresa. The, is the- This lead. one. Yeah, this one. She's what? She's what? The sister-in-law teacher. The sister-in-law? Yeah. Oh, okay. The sister-in-law. Okay, good, 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 good. Now, Andy is Sam's daughter and Martha is his... His what? His mother. No. Okay, Andy, Andy... Andy is Sam's, where is, oh, here is Sam, right? Here is Sam. Andy is Sam's grandfather. And Martha, Martha is his? Grandmother. Exactly. Grandmother, yeah. Exactly. All right, all right, all right. Chris is Sam's. Chris father is Sam's father. Really? Let me see. Father. 
Father. Father. Right. Manuel is Sam's. Uncle. 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 Very good. Very good. Sam is married to Yumiko. She is his. Why? Wife. Sam Sam's has a brother. He is married to Lisa. Lisa is Sam's. Sam has a brother. He's married to Lisa. Lisa is Sam's. Lisa is Sam's. Lisa is Sam's. Three. Sister-in-law. Sister-in-law. Sister Sister-in-law. And number eight, number six. Teresa is the daughter of Manuel. She is Sam's. Niece. Niece. Okay. She sounds not cousin. 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 Primo. Oh. Okay. Number okay. seven. What is the answer of number seven? Jimmy. Nice. Or knees. 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 Okay, let me see. If you got them right. Okay, guys, you're very intelligent. Very, Thank you, good teacher. Very smart teacher and students. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. Sure. Okay, let's go back to, okay, so we finished, you finished section one, two, three, four, five, right? Wilbur and, and Molina? What? 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 Did you finish uh, all the sections, Wilbur? No, uh, in this moment I, I am working to the section five. Oh, okay, now do me a favor. Uh, oh my God! It's almost it's almost time to to finish. But um, uh, do you have your computer uh, on? I mean, uh, can you can you can you share your screen and do section five, Wilbur, for five minutes? Your screen. Go ahead and share your screen with us. You have to share your screen with us. To my section five yeah to do your section five to do uh let me see one knowledge check oh let me see if you can do it see if you can do it time is almost up but it's okay go ahead I take the string, the spring, the spring, but yeah, you have to go like this share, share, and then you can do it. Um, let me, uh huh. Ra In this part, I, I, I am working. Right. Oh, okay. This is yours. Go ahead. I have, oh. finish, I have finished uh, 
tomorrow. Oh, this maybe. one, this one, this one. Oh, okay. See if you can do it in three minutes. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Okay. But okay. this is a screenshot, not the. the... Oh, no, it's got to be your screen. Oh. But I, I don't know how. You have to go for share, share, like this share, and then you have to go get your screen. Let me see. Oh, okay. This teacher. Ah, uh, next is gotta be the next, next, the next section. Right. There you go. Go ahead and do it. Do it. Do it. Let's do it. Fifty oh. percent <laughs> is what? Fifty percent is what? A lot of. A lot of. Okay. 87% is what? It's Not many, nearly some, nearly all, nearly all. In the United States, 0% of the people vote before the age of 18. There's no one vote. No one. Uh-huh. 35% of the people in Germany live alone. It's some. Yeah, Some people yeah, in Germany. right, right. Seventy-eight mm percent -hmm. of the American high school students have jobs. What is seventy-eight? Most. Um, most American. Go ahead and press enviar. Okay. All right, a hundred. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, very good job. Very good job. Okay, so basically you you're done with section five, right? You see. Oh, you're missing the last one. You can do it. Uh all right, thank you very much, Wilbur and uh, Ernesto Molina. I will see you on thank Monday. You. I will see you on Monday, yeah. uh, study and finish everything, okay? And you're ready to go to okay. pre-intermediate two. Good job. Have, good, a, good, have okay. a good night. Have a good night, people. Good, good night, teacher. Good okay. night, too. Bye-bye.